This is going to be a quick video on how to set up Seedstar XP to uh, set up a crop. Uh, what seed type, disc type, all that information, what population, what rates you, you want, you're uh, intending to use. Uh, if you don't see, uh, uh, this is going to be on a uh, command center on R-Series tractors or on uh, 1800 display. They're going to be the same type configuration except for on the command center, your keypad is going to be located over here on your uh, armrest. So if you don't see CSR XP on your display, you can always access it by going to your menu and then highlighting your planter icon. And we're going to go to the third tab down on the right side, which is our H tab. And we'll go into here, and that's going to be our what we're going to use to set up our planter rates. So at the top of the screen, you have a drop-down box. You can pick which uh, crop you'd like to use here. We'll stick with cotton. Then you can plant your, uh, uh, put in your target rate. So if I was planting, uh, which this would be a high, extremely high rate for cotton, we'll do soybeans here. And then do, um, uh, let's do 30,000, no, we'll do 130,000 seeds for soybeans. And that's another thing, this, uh, XP system uses uh, seeds per acre rather than pounds per acre information. When you type that in, it automatically calculates your high and low warning, and it's done does this by 10% above or 10% below. But if you'd like to manually change that, you could go in here and change that as well. Uh, then you got your population adjust. That's basically just a calibration of your your sensors. If you have an extremely high population or small seed. Uh, and your sensors are not able to pick it up, you're actually planting the correct amount of seed, but uh, your display's sh showing that uh, you're not, you're slightly under or over, you can go in here and adjust it on a 100% uh, scale. So think of this as 1.0 being 100%. So if you're 10% below, you would type in 1.10, that'd be 110%, and it'll calibrate your sensors up to, uh, to your target rate. Here, where you would choose whether you use, uh, if you this being a twin row planter, uh, whether you're planting a 24, all 24 rows or just 12 rows, and then at this population, it also gives us an average spacing of what we should, how many, uh, how far our seeds should be apart. Uh, that's basically going to be the uh, setup of, uh, of planter rates in a Seedstar XP planter using a com command center on R-Series tractors or 1800 display.